today we will draw the human face from front view i will suggest you to go to the other video where we were drawing the face from side view we have drawn the side face with a circle and a rectangle here we will draw a circle for the front view let us make the circle a sphere and cut two slices from both sides of the sphere now if we rotate the sphere towards left we will see the sphere like this if we will rotate it even more we will see the full width of the circle so for the side view we will see the full width of uh, circle or sphere but for the front view we will see the sliced form of circle or sphere in side view the line by the side of the circle is directional in side view the line by the side of the circle is directional line because the direction of the face is in that direction and on the line we have drawn the nose and the eye drawn the nose and the eye on the directional line actually we have drawn the nose and the eye for front view the directional line will come in the middle of the circle and the other line where we have drawn the ear that will go towards the right side of the sliced circle the line of the other ear that we cannot see will come to the left side of the sliced circle or sliced sliced sphere now we will extend the line by half of the radius of the circle and we will draw the horizontal line on the top of the circle and it will be a tangent of the circle if we ignore the middle line that is directional line then we will get a rectangle like the side face now we will make the rectangle half so we will get second rectangle then we will make the second rectangle half so we will get the third rectangle and we will make the third rectangle half so we will get the fourth one now in the end of the second rectangle we will draw the nose and on the line which divide the first and second rectangle we will draw the eyes side of the second rectangle we will draw the ears the height of the ear will be the height of the second rectangle that means from the eyes to the end of the nose the tip of the nose now we will define the hair line and cheekbone and understand the block of the face 
here I am showing it again. See, the side face will be wider than front face as I told you earlier. The, the entire circle is there in the side face and only slice circle is there in the front face. Now we will make the rectangle half, so we will get second rectangle. Then we will make the second rectangle half, so we will get the third rectangle and we will make the third rectangle half, so we will get the fourth one. Let's make the block of the face. if light is coming from the front of the face the face will look like this the two sides of the face the two sides of the nose under the forehead uh, under the forehead under the nose under the leaves and jaw the portions are towards depth 
will be dark it can make our model look flat so we will place our source of light in any of the side in an angle towards the face now see how it looks dark and highlight on it towards the direction of the light but we will not draw all the hair individually but we will create light and shade according to the block Next video we will learn the face from another angle.